um, I want to use this uh, opportunity to thank our social commission for coming to our aid. It's actually amazing that for just some persons to lend this family a phone for them to be able to cover the designs that the wife is, uh, is doing, is making rather. They are finding that as something too big to be done. It's a culture that we need to wake up in Africa to stop thinking just about ourselves and start being our neighbor's keeper. But we are so glad that as Cetros Foundation we are able to support this family with this phone, though it's not really very convenient for us at this point in time, but we just have to get out the phone so that everyone on this channel can be able to see what this uh, woman, the lady of the house, what she's producing from the training she already has, and I'm so glad that we are part of the success story. Good day everyone, this is Dasetro, the most handsome Yekebo Africanicious adrenaline pumping a fizzy power husband. And as usual, I will have my own baby lingo. <laughs> most pepperoni sugarlicious hot baby girl. <laughs> On today's show, I'm Joket Toluani Setro. It's a pleasure having you around today on the Setro's vlog. Uh the Cetros family. Yeah, in case you're not know, subscribed, please subscribe and press the notification bell. I want to say thank you to all that have been liking and commenting and to our patrons who say thank you. Don't forget to be part of our patrons for as well as three, the last month. And today, I'm still exhilarated. I'm excited and happy. You know, last year, uh, that was like 27th or 28th of December 2020. We told you after the Christmas distribution of the chicken to the families that there was a special family, the Bankole family, that their situation needed an urgent response because their means of livelihood was taken away from them due to the NSAS protest and they have little boys, children to take care of. So we had to quickly do a little help for them. And we told you about the part two, that the husband is a Baba and every other thing. But you know, the surprising thing is that immediately that woman, uh, that lady got that machine. She just started producing uh, clothes as in for the boys. For herself and she just started showing her skills and was so impressed by that. For giving me this opportunity to showcase my talent. And then I also want to thank them for the machine that they bought for me. Um, I want to use this uh, opportunity to thank our social commission for coming to our aid because I think it's not been very easy, you know. Since uh, COVID 19, was in the Kansas uh, protest, we've been going through a whole lot. And uh, you know, there's no money for us, it's only God that we're going to. So, God uses a central uh, foundation to, to rescue us to my wife. Now she's getting a machine to start this uh, soon. So, we are started um, contacting a customer that she's back with a machine. And I know that by the grace of God, this year will be better than last year for us. So I want to thank certain permission that um, God will continue to strengthen them. Because it's not easy. What our family can not even do. No, my, my, my family can not even get us anything. There's no, no, nobody that can. If you go and meet anybody who will send you away, they will tell you that the uh, um, citizen of the country is uh, somehow in the that they can't get. But I want to be part. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. So I want to show our central foundation in um, the little place that we're managing with my family. You can see my children. And uh, these are my two boys. And uh, this is my humble room that we manage. And uh, this is the machine that I'm talking about. So we are so grateful for uh, the machine. And uh, we want to shoot central for being there. Thank you. And we promise that um, when she's uh, when she has uh, stabilized, 
because that was the agreement we made. But when she has stabilized, she's going to train three good African youths for free. She will train three African youths for free. And she will train them to the best of her knowledge. She's going to make sure that she will make sure that they understand swimming. She will train them. That is what we are doing. They now needed the phone to snap and send to us or to do video and send to us so that people can actually hear from them. And uh, I tell you, we saw another side of how life could play out. Because this family was going through tough time, challenging time that we are so sure we ne those times will not last for long. They were begging people to lend them Android phone because the phone they have is this these uh, small small phones that cannot actually does not even have <laughs> a camera to record. They begged and begged, but surprisingly, no one was even ready not to give them the phone. No one was ready to just help in covering the handwork of this hardworking woman to send to us. It took them two weeks. I tell you this, two weeks. They were literally begging people to come and help them so that the whole world can see what this woman can do, what she can deliver. But I found that so hard to believe till a friend of ours had to physically go to this couple's house which is a very uh, far distance to where we uh, where, where we are based until he went there and decided to help them to cover it with his phone when i saw this video last night sure i couldn't sleep i was just wondering how is life why are people like this just for you to help your fellow human being you're not dashing them the phone just for you to just help them to cover the... Oh my God. Anyway, we don't want to talk too much about that. So immediately we saw what this lady can do. We decided that just like the same way we help to buy the other lady in the thick forest of uh, Edo State or somewhere, uh, we are going to buy this family a phone, a very good phone, so that they can continue to make videos. So we made our promise and we are keeping to that promise because... We are going to ensure that this family, they have their own YouTube channel where she can display what she's producing. And we also want to mentor her. We want to mentor her so that she can advance in fashion. And as a result of that, we have decided to give her a 50,000 Naira worth of online training from our fashion school, Central Fashion School. We are giving her this training free of charge if she asks questions or what have you that she needs uh, to be guided she is free we are going to release our personal line to her we are going to mentor her in the realm of fashion and the good thing is that this woman is into male and female wow okay i think we are just going to up the game we are not going to give her the fifty thousand naira worth of class because the fifty thousand naira uh, online training is just for female fashion. I'm also going to give her my own male online fashion, another 50,000 naira worth of class. So we are giving this family a hundred thousand free online fashion class training for both male and female, and we will help to assist let me be very clear because most of the time i'm tight my wife will help to assist in full uh, mentoring on whatsapp and i will try my best to see how i can scheme out time to guide her in some areas when it comes to male fashion but we are just so happy because this is how life should be they are getting their phone today and guess what um, if not that we were working with, uh, we we're trying to manage fund, we would have loved to get the husband a clipper. But let's see how it goes. If we get to the market and 
we can still be able to afford getting the husband a clipper. What we intend doing is that since uh, where we are working on, so that uh, the physical place that we are working on, so that we can bring uh, all these uh, youths that we are empowering, we have not yet uh, done with that. We are still working on how to get funding so that we can get a physical place. What we'll do is to buy this husband a very sound clipper. And since we've gotten them a phone, we are going to mentor him on how to be doing home services. Because the greatest challenge is not starting at all. So far they've started, then we should just keep on the tempo. By the time the husband is getting inflow uh, for the family from barbing, and the wife is getting inflow from fashion, I tell you that's what we call financial concussion. <laughs> and as such, I believe that they, they are going to be fine. So later on, when the foundation is now able to set up a place for them, we can bring both of them in. They will be in each of the sections. The wife can be in the female, uh, female fashion section, while the husband can be in the barbing section of the Cetros Foundation Mall. So with that being said, we want to say this is very, very interesting and we are so happy and proud to be associated with this family. Please, we are begging all of you, in case you are seeing this video and you are in Lagos, try and patronize. Maybe we, we, might, be, we might be doing some updates on this particular family. Try and patronize the husband. If we are able to eventually get the clipper for the husband, we'll beg you that please try to patronize the husband because uh, what he will just need now is home services. So if you are in Lagos, you can just put a call across to the family just to help the family. Put a call across to them so that they can come to your location and give you some nice haircut so that this man can take care of the beautiful wife and the beautiful and some godly children and with that whenever you are in the world the designs of this particular woman what we are going to do is to help improve on it and we are going to tell her to go to the studios nearby studios so that they can do some nice shots and the likes please patronize this family this family needs they need your support. They need our support. So by the time we are going to be showcasing their product, please, we want you to just patronize them. Just patronize them. I don't know the kind of English to call it. Okay. By so doing, you make the world a better place. Uh, helping someone in need. When you are in need, you also find help. And that's it. That's the joy therapy today. Making sure that you see others smile. Then the world will be a better place. Once you don't have a bad mind, you're joyful and you want joy for others, not pain. Do you understand? So don't forget the joy therapy as we wrap up today. That's what's living for. Just make sure you keep your joy, whatever is happening. It gives you strength to keep on fulfilling your destiny. And what of the hug therapy? So before we go, always remember in 2021, hug your spouse 21 times per day. It's because what we call political palongos. And as it's from us, the Cetrus, to you, we love you, catch you, bye-bye. Please, before we go, the best way you can support us on this channel so that we can continue to do this beautiful job that we live for, please, like, subscribe to our channel, the Cetrus, like our and share channel. subscribe Kind, kindly subscribe to our new channel the cetros like and share our videos we really appreciate this it matters to us thank you so very much you may like to watch this video or this